Welcome to Blackpool. Here for the uh, the Ghosts and Gardens event. Um, so we get to go behind the scenes. I went on the ride earlier today, saw the new scenes, which look fantastic. Um, so let's get inside and uh, see a little different view. Welcome everyone to the third Bank Club event of uh, this year. Very nice to see you all and uh, here this evening. We know that there's some other stuff going on with the grabbing of old land. So it's quite So the ghost train is the original ghost train opened in 1930, not as the ghost train, as the pretzel ride. And then in those days, if this or died, a right this or died by the number of tickets for the soul. Um, pretzel didn't mean anything in the 1930s to the UK population. And there was a film um, out on play at the time called The Ghost Train, and someone came up with a great idea of putting two scenes around the ride, which they did. The ride was an instant hit, and this Ghost Train led to every single one of the Ghost Trains you can see uh, around the world. And the version that you're looking at now got moved a little bit from further down. It used to all be on one level, and um, we've got Joseph Emberton, who is responsible for quite a few of the famous buildings around the park. To thanks for the way that um, it looks um, today. In 1936, he moved it, added a second level to it, and, and then it did actually get rebuilt with the file in the 1950s. Um, but that's kind of the thing possible for the version that we see today. The great thing about the Ghost Train is it's never really finished. We're always tinkering with it. We've been on it this year or today. Hopefully, you know it's a bit different than it was last year. Um, and obviously, we're going to see it in a way that you wouldn't normally see the season. So that's the Ghost Train. The other part of the evening is the Steeple Chase. Well, you have a picnic, the way we put it up in the sunshine the other morning. The Steeple Chase was built by Aerodynamics in 1977. It's opened by Ben Rum. And it's now the only one of its kind operating left in the world. It's had a sister ride, which was um, Wacky Soapbox uh, races at Not Free Farm. Actually, on four lanes, not three. I was in box three, including the elusive yellow lane. Where's the sponsor? No, so if you've got all three, if you're one of those people that counts them all three different credits, then the yellow one's the difficult one to get. Um, okay, so you also can get, get up close to that as well. How Oh, 
over onto this side. So the ride is split into four sections, and this the section we've just been through is section one, and we're just going to go up the lift to get into section two. All right. Now remember, when we said here, you need to stay on the walkway on the side of the lift. All right. Just watch your head.
watch your head, guys. Watch your head again, guys. Watch your head again, guys. Thank you. It's all over the Watch your head on the side, guys. Just go to the Watch your head, guys. What's that? Okay. It's alright. 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 It's Watch your head. Sandy. So uh, I know there's a lot of people that kind of say Blackpool hasn't really looked after the Laughing Man, but he's had a paint job and he's been done up and uh, the park's closed right now, we're here for this event, but uh, he was laughing very loudly and he's been painted and he's been redressed so I have to say I'm actually quite impressed with the park this this close season they've done a lot of stuff to kind of spruce things up and um, obviously there's other areas that still need some TLC but there's only so much you can do in three or four months right so that's off to Blackpool Pleasure Beach or Pleasure Beach Resort or Pleasure Beach Lancaster whatever they call themselves these days well, that was good fun getting a walk around the uh, the ghost train. I've uh, seen it from a very different perspective. Um, and now we get some free donuts and a hot drink and then get to walk around Steeplechase. Which, uh, I'm not going to say it. I was going to say the rain stopped. I have just said it, which probably means it's going to start raining again. <laughs> Yeesh.
Yes. Yes. Oh, good. Good. Hey, guys, you're all right. Thank you. Thank you. This is kind of weird. Park is completely empty because it's closed and we've just finished the event. Um, and of course this bad boy, Grand Prix, that's going. And I was gonna leave a big space. So I'm super curious about what they're gonna do with it. But anyway, hats off to, uh, to Pleasure Beach for another great event. It's always great to see behind the scenes of things. <laughs> Especially on the ghost train where walking past triggers everything. So as everybody walked past stuff, all the effects went off and, you know, jump scares and stuff, which was great. So anyway, if you have enjoyed this, hit that like button. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button because uh, I'm trying to hit 10k. I've got a nice drive ahead of me now. So uh, I've been Chris, you're watching Ghost of Dad. See you, see you probably in Alton Towers. Adios.